fun fun story. I haven't done anything. <clears throat> I was trying to get my stuff back, which is my bags down there, like 70 meters below. And I ended up over here, which is like a I'm not sure how I got here, but I'm here. And then I tapped this. In a lab note. Not sure if you've noticed, but half the doors in this busted heap are gooped up and rendered inoperable and the other half have been have screaming juvenile orb weavers jazzed up on some sort of teenage arachnid hormone juice trapezing behind them. The stink of a brood mother is thick in the air. We can only hope that she's not setting up shop purse permanently. I whipped up some schematics for repurposing those Tazy T underling units for defense. Will be the most popular babysitter on the block in just a few weeks' time if we don't get the whole this whole pickle sorted in addition to our other problem. Remind me to pen another letter about the birds and the bees for Sarah and Thor, except this time about human puberty. Thank the heavens you don't have new protuberances or underarm apocrine sweat glands, Burgle, for your sake and mine. Ooh. It's an ant. to get my stuff. Okay, now we sit back and figure out what the fuck's going on. Worse than my mom's Brussels sprouts. Let's get my food back up. My water back up. Okay. I want to go into here. If this is anything. Ah, it is something. What's that? Wait a... What? This comes out here? Okay, so I must be able to get back up into the lab from the bottom then. Must be. There's very science in there. I kind of want it.
Okay. Okay, this is looking good. And we're back. Maybe not where we wanted to be. But we're back. We just need to figure out where we actually are. So I was somewhere else last time. I might we'll check the Google thing, because I, I had to Google how to get up there. Doors to pick from. Okay, so I need to go back to where I just was, where that computer was. So I need to find out how to get back there. Yeah, it's in there. Okay. Okay, now from here, it says, I don't know what that is, but uh, I'm about to find out. Spiders are up to no good. Is juniors of them? Research analyzer. Workbench. That's kind of cool. Then what? So the password segment. Okay, so I go down this hallway. I'm just, I'm literally just reading through a, um, tutorial. Ah! Okay. <coughs> hey, what the fuck? 
bitch. Back to the analyzer room. Oh, okay, so I go back to the analyzer room, which is this one. And take the zip line down. Oh, okay, I need it. Okay, that's good, that's good. Another password scribble. Zip line down, you'll need a small room immediately. See, okay, so I break through here, there's nothing else in here. into the room with the and hit up the ramp up the ramp ah motherfucker I'm raiding you diagonally cross and keep hitting up Head up to the long tunnel and stock up on anything you want. If you really want, you can toss all the grass planks and weed stems off the ledge and gather them up in the ground. Okay. This side up halfway down. Okay, so I go up to the storage room that I found ages ago. Literally just reading this through a guide, so... Yeah. Ah, I drop onto here. He told me to save first, so I'm gonna save. I wanna save. Apparently there's some bad guys down here. Supplemental log, ominous practical technologies, totally. Do whatever, I'll sort it later. The important thing is I have done it! Success! The spacer has worked its magic. 
I have successfully shrunk a set of basic plastic polyhedral dice from the size of standard dice to no bigger than the size of, well, much smaller dice. Uh, Burgle, make a note to come up with a better comparison. Noting. Nonetheless, this is a complete exoneration. However, it occurs to me that I have a new problem. The dice were intended to be young foe's Christmas present. He will be disappointed. But perhaps I can convince him that they were miniature dice. The tiny instructions might be a bit of a giveaway. A new solution may be required. To the fun pit toy mart before they close. So didn't take me to the book. Back off. Okay, and then I go into this room. Maybe. Maybe it's this one. What? Head back up to the tunnels all the way to the power... Ah. Thank you for cobbling together this thoroughly disgusting respirator unit and eating it. Oh, I'm probably going down this room there. Oh. Hedge lab. I want to take this gas mask. Ah, so that's the hedge maze complete, apparently. That's all the doors done, everything's reopened. this gas mask. It's kind of cool. Okay, um... Hey! Dick. Hey! Talk about this. Ah!
So I would like to find a way out of here. Cool. That was the scary part I was worried about. It's fine, it's only dysentery. Oh. Tiny Pete needs food badly. Eat or die. Better than starving, I think. That eat or die thing is new. So I think I just got the achievement for complete the hedge lab. Yes, yeah, sweet. So I already know of the other lab we've got to complete. And it's scary. It's, um, it's underwater. So the next lab we have to con So yeah, the next lab we have to complete is the underwater one the pond. Now, that's another one I'm gonna have to Google and find a guide for. Because I have no idea how to do that one. For now, I'm completely out of the loop when it comes to uh, that. But we did that now. So we have completed the hedge lab. Got the power back on. Got every... Got everything sorted. Now we're good. So what I think I'm going to do for the rest of today is try and get the ladybug armor. I think that would be a good idea. So... Need two more acorn shells. Let's go get those acorn shells so we can uh, put all the stuff away. I'm just spinning all that web fiber. It's like... It's like one acorn, maybe two. Need to get to the point where I can do this boss. This down. boss is gonna be sick. That's gonna be like the final thing I do. And hopefully I can do that before any updates come out. Like I really hope I can get that complete before any new updates get added. 
then it's like the final thing. Once the boss is done, I wait till another update. Another big sized update at least. I can break these, can't I? So I need to build a berry leather chair. We need the chair. The chair is the best thing. Hold up, do I not have any sap? I've gone through my supplies of sap. It's actually really surprising. Because I never use sap. Oh yeah, building a base is something I also want to do. Lounge. Oh! Oh, that looks so relaxing. Okay, I can relocate that. Because what I want to do is I want to build... Like a floating base. Somewhere. Maybe on here. No, that looks great. Still need that extra acorn. Do you have the right mutations on at the moment? Because I know I changed some of them around. Yep. There you go, one more acorn. <clears throat> Stretchy legs. I will eventually build a house. Eventually. I just don't know where I'd put it, because if I put it like too close that way, then I'm gonna get attacked by spiders all the time. But we could just build it on the lily pads. Anyway. So. Let's put all, like, late game stuff in here. I guess the gas mask counts for that. So, like, uh, that stuff. These. side in there. These are all like late game items that you don't usually use. Guess we could put some of the weird wacky foods I've got as well. Where are those? Yeah, these things. From the cookie sandwich. And the beefers. And... Also put all the bee armor in there. Cause I don't know if at the Ooh, big yawn. I don't know if at the moment I plan on repairing that. If 
a lot of spider webs to go through. That as well needs to come with. Now let's sort out this inventory. Nice. Bow. Hammer. Axe. That's nice. Better than starving, I think. Didn't want to eat that. Okay. Oh wait. Let's have a look at what we need for this um, armor. Ladybug. So two parts. Six. Eleven. I have five. We have the ladybug head. I think it just costs berry leather after that. Flower petals as well. Four, two. I need six flower petals as well. There are flower petals over here. There's also spiders over here. I think that's all the flower petals we need. Two for that. But yeah, okay, we got six. That's all the flower petals. Shit, I didn't mean to shoot him. Too late. You can break them! Okay. Turns out... They can break the clovers. I didn't know that. That was a really smooth fight though. Like a really smooth kill. I need... Three more. I need three more parts. And then we just go get the berry leather. That's like one more ladybug kill. If I can kill one more ladybug. How much berry leather do we need? Three... Seven, 
11. Okay, 11 times 3. I need 33 dairy chunks. I believe. Because it's like 3 for 1. The spinning wheel making the noise. <clears throat> I'm just trying to figure out what it was. So we'll head back to the hedge. And we can like... I guess we just shoot berries, like the ones that we can hit. We just shoot them. Because I'm not going back up to the mate, to the lab to look for more berries that are like accessible and maybe tomorrow because I'm trying to post these daily uh, it'll be a later one than usual because I have to go out in the day but maybe tomorrow we could do the pond lab <clears throat> you so much. Barbarian? Ooh, club damage. I need that. I need club damage. That would be so nice. Plus, I want to grab some of these, I believe. Toadstool chunk. I believe I can make stuff with these. Go this way. Still like a whole nother section of the map I haven't explored. Which is over that side. And up in there as well. Isn't that like a water flea? something. I don't know. I didn't really play very much when they added the pond update. So I don't know much about it. That scared me. What the fuck? It's rash. Is it this guy? Must be. Yeah. It's that guy.
No, it'll be nice to... Quite excited to get the, um... The two labs out of the way. Because I never knew the hedge lab was that big. There's a bit of it collapsed on the ground, like, in there that I haven't actually gone to. Yet. And I might do that if it's still in the game. Because I didn't know it was all up in the sky. Hopefully we can get this done as quickly as possible. Bows damaged. I don't have anything to repair it. There's little bits of plant fiber around here, so I'm sure if I find enough. Four, five, six, okay. It's a really fun game. If you've got access to it, I don't know how expensive it is. But like, if you're on Xbox and have Game Pass, get it. It is so much fun. Also, I, I never showed it off, but if you're scared of spiders, there is an arachna like arachnophobia, Ar arachno, arachno. Is that one? I think it is, it's just stuck. I don't want to go too far, because you get to a point where it's just spiders. Speaking of spiders... Slightly too far for my liking. Back it up a little. Yeah. 
What's back this way? It's just more hedge. Now that I know what the defrag button does, I quite like it. It's a really nice... What's the time? 17.09. Okay. Well, I think we'll head out. Although we might need to come back. Is that one? We drop down one more berry. I think we just grab one chunk. Okay, okay, I don't like that idea. Just for safety, we'll grab. Now that mosquito scares me because of what happened last time with the mosquitoes. Do I have the ingredients to make a trail marker? Clovers. One clover leaf. I'm sure I'll find a sprig while going over there. I think there's a way you can get on the bird bath. I just haven't done it yet. But I'm not here for the bird bath. When do I shoot the bird? I was just checking out if there are any crow feathers. But I want to stick a trail marker here. I want to make it like lab. What's the map marker for the labs? Like that. I want to make him pink. Because then there's one lab there. And then there's going to be one lab over by my house. Or what I might make is my house. You never know. Maybe I'll begin the building of the, um, of my house in secret and show it to you guys when it's like am I done I don't remember if these guys are hostile they're not 
if I slap him? very hostile and they really hurt okay. now let's hit back oh my inventory's full phone just went off so I'm gonna quickly check that just in case it's something important that was important I will tend to that in a second Let's head back to the tree. We'll sleep. And then I think that'll actually be the video over. Where am I? What's over there? I've been really productive. Like, really productive today. Shit, they're moving closer. Cardio fan, two out of three. Is that one I have equipped it? It is. That one's upgraded just by running. I know that. It's just the more you run, it'll upgrade. Which is kind of cool. Kind of nice. Okay, so I can't put this away yet. It's a giant mess. Tiny Pete's ready for sleep. Tiny rest. Stretch the legs out. Put the sap away. I needed it. Just a little bit more. Feeling a little safer now. Pieces. What do I need for the legs? What do I exactly need? I can put two of this in there. Now we need to go hunt a ladybug.
better than starving, I think. I should get like a do collector so I can collect water for in the mornings and instead of relying on this juice box next to me. There we go. Ladybug. I feel like I'm getting a little bit better with the combat. Like, just a little bit better. I think we'll make the spider armor and then I think we'll treat ourselves to a little bit of a fight with a wolf spider. Like, I think that could be a fun challenge. I'm absolutely going to be utilizing, like, the, the easy to mess up AI, but they don't need to know about that. So, yeah, let's. That should keep me safe. Mm, safe fur. Scarlet Embrace. What's Scarlet Embrace? How do I see that? Defrag that out. What does it cost to repair the mint mace? Two flower petals. Three. Okay. Let me let me grab three silk rope. Three quartz. Then we'll go grab a couple flower petals. Because I feel like it would be. So so good to get that insect bow. Because with that, I feel like I would be like just just amazing. How many petals was it? Two. One. I kind of want to kill one of those guys as well, but... <laughs> yeah. And stuff stuck in my throat. But I think... 
We're gonna save the game. wary that this guy will like two shot me. That didn't feel very successful. It's also really dumb to come in here. You know, it, it felt successful, but... Got a bit more cheesed. It's kind of why I tried to jump in there at the end, but... I still wanted to make sure I would win the fight. How did an arrow end up down here? Nah, they're pretty feisty to kill though, because they um they have really bad poison attacks. So they can practically one shot you, like you they hit you once. You get poisoned. Their first hit hits you for majority of your health, and then you're dead anyway. Oh, I need two spider fangs. So I need to kill another one. Oh. <sighs> Need to kill another one. Okay. There doesn't seem to be any more in there. So 
I'm just collecting the materials to build a um another one of these for my base. House. Oh, it's a green. So yeah, that didn't feel successful. But it was. I killed the guy. Which in the end is realistically all that matters. Okay. Choke it down, Pete. Uh, speed off a little bit. Have a drink. Plus, I have no idea where I'm going to actually find another spider. Because I don't think there's going to be any more in there. Because, well, I was literally just in there. And these guys don't drop the fangs. Only the wolf spiders do. Unless I could possibly find another one, or there just is another one in there. That sounds like one. That sounded like one. I swear I heard one like s snoring. Did they snore? I guess I could just fight him hand to hand. Bastard can hear. Let us. Oh. You're not very cool then. kind of like depressing I've been talking so much about these wolf spiders being difficult all you have to do is stand in a leaf and you can shoot them the hardest part about the fight was finding the spider
That's what happened. I ran out of arrows. Ah! What the fuck? You were not my fight. Weavers just aren't as difficult as the other ones, though. Like, finding them in hand to hand is easy because they don't poison you. It's the poison that fucking gets you. But I ran out of arrows in that fight, so I need to. I only have 46, 44 arrows. I had like 60 for that first guy. So we're gonna have to make some more arrows before we do Broodmother. I want the Stinger Spear, but I've already got all this. Venom arrows could be cool. <laughs> Might make some of those. Now we got an insect... Insect bow. Deposit stack. And we'll grab two more of this. To make more of this. That's cool. So now I just have to figure out if I'm titling this episode um, Fighting Wolf Spiders or Finishing the uh, Hedge Lab. I think killing a wolf spider is a bit cooler. So we're going to go with that anyway. Thank you. That was really fun. I really enjoyed myself. We got lots done. Next step, I'm thinking, is... Sorry, just stretching and yawning. Holy shit. Oh, that's better. No, it's not. It's still going. Jeez. All right. Oh, that feels so much better. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a young bouncing baby boy okay next step I think is the pond lab yeah I think next time we explore the depths go figure out what they're all about cuz then actually let me just look through some of these achievements I'm not sure what other stuff there is, like, story-wise, or s tame a bug as a pet? How? I think we, we are going to have to have a look into some other things. I just remembered something. I haven't done the burgle shit. Burgle, I got a burgle chip from thing. I was planning on signing out without doing that. All right, I gotta do that. Oh, don't even need to boil it. Worse than my mom's Brussels sprouts. He needs some more audio cues for like food. They're kind of boring. It's the same lines over and over, but it's alright. Yeah, I think I got some stuff for Burgle. Oh, Burgle. Hey, man. Is there anything else what? I can help you with? If you have any extra Ross, do I have? Holy shit! I have enough. Daredevil unlocks a mutation that reduces fall. That's boring. Zipline. Ladders. But I want meat shield. 
I've been grinding for meat shield. So I'm buying meat shield. And then we should probably get like some good building blocks. That one would also be really good. Like for the boss, I'd probably use that one, the max health one, and then the damage in my mace. Because then I can beat the shit out of him. Like that just seems realistic to me. Zipline sounds really fun. So does the ladder. 7,500. That's fair. It would be really, like, really overpowered to have ziplined. Thinking those fortified bases and multi story are good. Work. Fallen oak branch. Rake Rock Point. I know where both of those are, and they both suck. That's where all the mites are, so that one's not so bad. That's where I killed those beetles. Right. We'll do those later. Meat Shield! Yeah. Oh, that one could also be really nice. That's for club damage. That one's good. Hyper sta Do we need hyper stamina? We just have a look what it's like without it. I think it just regens faster. Actually, I don't know. I'm actually starting to unlock quite a couple of these. Spare, that's not needed. I don't need that. Ant Annihilator. Yeah. That, that just gives me more ant damage. The more ants I kill, I'll get that. Should we, should we do a Google? We're doing a Google. I'm pulling up Google. Grounded. Um, mutations. I want to have a look at some of the mutations there are. Buff lungs. Increases stamina by 20 percent that's not bad that's for 5,000 yeah then there's daredevil which reduces full damage by 25 percent I haven't had any issues with full damage except for when I fell out of the tree 20 percent more max health is good what the fuck chop 20 f chop 50 blades of grass Okay, so you you increase your chopping efficiency by 25, then 50, then 100%. So to get phase one, you have to chop 50 blades of grass. That's a lot. Then 200, then 500. Rock cracker. Rock cracker, all right. Increases busting efficiency by 25, then 50, then 100, as usual. <clears throat> and then... Um, 25 rocks, 75 rocks, 100 rocks. This one is the ant damage one. That's kill 50 ants, then 100, then 150. That increases your damage by 5%. Five, 5%. Then 15, then 25. Phase 3 increases damage resistance to ants. That's quite nice. Um, 
two times damage with barehanded attacks, you have to kill 50 creatures with your fist. Coupe de Grasse. Um, discover the four leaf clover landmark. 10% chance for critical hits. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's like just a random one. Uh, juicy, discover all five juice boxes. Thirst and hunger decrease 50% slower. Holy shit, that's nice. Natural Explorer. Is that the one that I have upgraded? That's this one here. Yeah. So I found 20 landmarks. And that increases my sprint speed. So that makes you run faster. Uh, to get phase 3 of that one, you need to discover all 50 landmarks. Cardio fan. Holy shit exhaust the player a hundred times so that's run your stamina all the way to the bottom a hundred times then 200 i've done it 250 times you need to do it 500 too that increases your stamina regen reliable friend increases player revival speed by 15 25 40 i'm never going to get that one because i don't really play with friends Revive a friend 5 times, 15 times, 30 times. Sharpshooter increases damage by with bows. Oh, I want that one. Kill 50 creatures with a bow. Kill 100. Kill 200. Ah, oh, fresh defense. That's the one I've got from picking up a mint chunk. That, um, that, that doesn't actually do what I thought it would. That only increases your resistance to stink bugs, bombarded air beetles, and the haze by 25. So I'm actually going to take that one off, because that's not necessary for me. That one's better. Cause that's not that's not the best. Okay. Smasher. Kill f enemies with one-handed hammers, like the the insect hammer. Weird. Uh, that increases damage with those hammers by 10, 20, 30 percent. Okay. Mertine. Discover three underwater landmarks. Increases. Underwater oxygen time by 10 and swim speed by 15. That's quite nice. Javelinier. Kill 50 enemies with a spear. 200 for max. That just increases your damage. Then there's increases damage with daggers. Kill, fifth, kill 200 for max. Yep. Um, axes. Increases damage with axes. It's the barbarian one, which I've got. That's so good. That's so good. Immunity to venom. Kill five wolf spiders. I've killed two. If I kill three more, maybe tomorrow, I could get that one. Mom jeans. Kill the hedge brood mother. Okay. Spawns friendly spiderlings on 10% of strikes to enemies. That's kind of cool. Oh, okay. The natural explorer one can only be leveled up to phase two since there's only. There's currently less than 50 total landmarks. So they'll probably add more. <laughs> okay so there's heaps of little things so I could do the um the ones I would probably want
for the broodmother fight. It's that one. That one. Maybe even that one. Like, I feel like I'm probably ready to try it now. But I don't want to. I want to wait. Also, killing 50 enemies with your fists, man. That's a lot. It's a lot of enemies just beaten to death with your fists. Killing five wolf spiders though and becoming immune to venom sounds so good. Either way, I think we've we've I think I've played a bit too much today, but it's been good. It's been productive. So I'm thinking tomorrow we'll go out there. Go into the deep, unwatery so. depths. And we will discover what the pond one gives us. Uh, find out what's in the pond lab. Woo! So that'll, that'll be up tomorrow afternoon, maybe. Maybe t tomorrow night. Whenever I get it done, it'll be up. And I'm really excited. Because that means the brood mother is coming close. Well, it's nearly there. It's nearly tr nearly time to kill the brood mother. I'll probably run like try it once with what I think will be good, see how it goes, and then try it again if I fail. Like if because I don't, I kind of hope I don't do it first try. I want to have it like a challenge to work up to. If you get what I mean. Oh, I need to show you guys this cool spider thing. Arachnophobia safe mode. So that's it like that. And then like that. It loses all its legs. And then it turns into that. Then it turns into that. Then that. Then that. And that's it. So if you are like scared of... If you have arachnophobia, you can make your spiders look like that. Personally, I don't mind. But I know people do. So you could have that. Oh, they're cool. Okay, I'm getting off topic. I need to I need to end this here, because I gotta go eat. So have a good day. All of yours.